we want to show you a really cool way how to customize your home screen and possibly you've got um, someone that maybe has trouble isolating a finger or entering phone numbers uh, into their phone keypad maybe because the numbers are so small or it's just hard to kind of get them to do the extra steps by clicking on the phone going to contacts we know you can set up favorites but we have a way to kind of make it easy to put those favorites or those frequently called people on your home screen you can even add pictures we want to show you a quick way how to do that so that it will look something like this we're going to use the widgets option so the fastest way to do that is just i would go to an open home screen where you've got some space i would hold down my finger until you see the icons kind of start to wiggle you're going to tap on the plus button in the top left hand corner and then it's going to open up all the different widgets so i'm going to scroll down until i see contacts and it's going to give me some options once i choose that i found if i'm looking for a bigger contact then I choose the first option, but I could swipe across to the right to see different options. So you could have six together in a nice little cluster. You could have four together in a cluster. But again, to have a bigger display, it would, it would take up more of my home screen if I did that. I could just choose the individual one. Once I have it, I hold down the widget after I click done and I say edit widget and then I can change the name of the person. So we'll just say, for example, I am going to choose, oh, I'm just going to choose this person right here. So now I'm going to um, tap out in the open area and I notice that I see some initials there. If I want to give that person a picture, then I'm going to open up my contacts and I've got to find that contact and add a picture or even a different icon for that person. So I am going to go to edit and find an icon. You can also add a picture from your photo roll of that person as well. So there's a nice little icon and I can choose next. I could scale it if I needed to. And this is especially helpful if it's a picture. I'm gonna say choose, and that person will now be centered or that will now be centered. So if I go through and keep clicking done, there is my nice little widget that I added. I can keep continue to add more. And once I've done that, I can move them so that it looks kind of like what you see here. So it almost looks like a phone keypad, especially if I added a sixth widget, that, um, but it's just larger and maybe easier to um, dial. If I tap on that button, then I can choose to call them, video call them, what we call FaceTime, email them or message them. We hope this has been helpful and you can check out other cool videos like this on our Bridging Apps YouTube channel.